Hi Libra, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your mid-May reading. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, middle of May. Just going to see what comes up. There's a new opportunity. Somebody may be realizing that there's a new opportunity here. Leaving behind an old relationship that they've been holding on to. <laughs> and I'm not laughing at you. I'm laughing because I got the message. I know some people take things the wrong way. You make one wrong word, you see one wrong anything, and people jump on it, but whatever. Anyhow, somebody is realizing that they are holding on to a relationship that isn't meant to be, and they are walking away. Realizing that there's a better opportunity. There's no reason to cry over this anymore. I've held on to it long enough. This relationship is not happening. I'm walking away. And they probably really have another opportunity for love. And you may just be deciding, you know, i got to hold on to the new opportunity. i got to hold on to this love opportunity. Somebody is holding on to a partnership, okay? Whether it's an old one or a new one, this is holding on to a partnership. But this is realizing that there is an opportunity for love. So let's get some more cards. Whew! So somebody has been resisting change, avoiding the truth for quite some time. Things have been turned upside down because somebody's been in a state of avoidance. Two, two, two. Two, two, two. Faith and trust. Balance. There's a need to bring balance back to your life. Things are unbalanced right now. They are. I mean, take a look at it. We got one upright and two reverse. Things are, you know, it's the downside, okay? There's, it's, it's unbalanced in a way that, you know, there's something that you need to let go of. Okay? It's an old relationship. And you don't, I mean, I know a lot of you don't want to hear this, but this is an old relationship that needs to be let go of so that you can find wish fulfillment. I mean, there's, it's unbalanced. I mean, it is. There's an opportunity for a new relationship here. There absolutely is. But you can't keep holding on to the one that you are maybe avoiding, letting that's blocking you. There's a relationship that is blocking you from a happy union. Okay? But you're, somebody is holding on to the bitter end, and that is no joke. Okay? Holding on to the bitter end. Determined. Determined to block anybody new. Determined to hold on to the... Uh, unhappy relationship. I mean, I can't make that up. I think we got somebody here that's growing weary from holding on. Ooh, here we have this empress. So this could be you. This is this is if you are the Libra female, <laughs> this is absolutely you, right? If you're the Libra female, this is you standing in your power. This is you knowing your worth, glowing at this time. If you are the Libra male, you may be coming into contact with this woman. This woman, she's the pick of the litter. She's the choice. She doesn't chase opportunities. Opportunities chase her. So if you are the Libra female, you probably have multiple options at this time. Multiple. You are probably, you know, very beautiful. You're glowing. Your uh, people are probably flocking to you. They are. People are probably seeing your beauty in a big, big way. If you are the Libra male, you may you may have your eyes on an empress who is absolutely beautiful. Okay, 
could be a Taurus, could be another Libra, could be any other woman. This woman, she doesn't settle for less than she deserves. If you are the Libra woman and you are the one that is holding on, you need to realize that you don't need to settle. You need to realize that you are the pick. You are the choice. You need to realize what you are worth. This is also the birth of a new life. So you guys may be basically giving birth to a new life right now. Maybe you are letting go of something. This is a loss. Maybe you're throwing something away or you're letting it go or you're letting it drop away or you're just getting rid of it. It's just like, you know what? I've held on long enough. I'm letting this go. I'm worth more. So some of you are in that mind of, state of mind like, I'm worth more than this. I'm worth more than this. I know that I am. You know, I'm going to let this go. I'm letting this go. There's nothing solid, nothing stable here. I've, I've held on long enough. I've, I've blocked a relationship and I'm letting go. So I know my worth. So some of you may be starting a brand new life. Nurturing yourselves, taking care of you. After holding on, you guys have held on to something for quite some time. Um, oh my God, you have, and it's weighed you down. It has. Somebody has been carrying a heavy weight, a heavy burden overwhelmed with this heaviness you come to a point where you can't do it anymore you have to let it go now you got an offer of love coming in so i feel like you do i think libra you do have an offer of love coming in or if you're the libra male this is you with you're ready you're ready for love and you may be deciding that you are going to go offer love to this beautiful woman you know you probably see her you know, you've probably been reluctant to offer. You Maybe you've been blocking it because you were holding on to something else. But, you know, you, 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 you're you ready. It's like you're ready to go. She's, she's ready. She's beautiful. Now, this is a person that doesn't have good intentions. Somebody has been in a relationship with somebody that didn't love them. Turned their lives upside down, probably walked away. This person may have had a wandering eye. They didn't have any follow through. They didn't have any integrity. And it's caused a lot of sleepless nights. It's caused a lot of worry. It's caused a lot of regrets. And it's like there's 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 no they're not coming back. You know, they're, they're, that's what it is. It's like they're not coming back. Um, two of Wands. There's a lot of indecisiveness here. I think that the, the, that you have been restricting yourself. You've, you have. You've been restricting yourself from growth. You've been restricting yourself from your new beginning, a new romance, a new relationship because of well, you keep repeating your own patterns. You keep doing the same things. You keep wanting to go back to a player. This is my player card. So it feels like you guys have been played. You may have... been restricting yourself for a person that is emotionally unavailable, not invested in a loving way. And it's like now, I think now it's like, I don't know if you are realizing. It's like, yeah, I think you are realizing that it's time to move forward. It's time to find that confidence and that courage to move forward. So I think we got somebody coming to the rescue here. This is a warrior. This is somebody coming to the rescue. This is a real warrior. Recognizing your worth. So if you are the female, you probably have somebody coming into your life that sees exactly who you are. They see your beauty. They see your value. They see your abundance. They see. They think that you're beautiful. And they're probably offering you something. They're actually offering you something. They may be asking you out on a date or they may be saying all kinds of beautiful things to you, you know. If you are the male watching this, this is you. This is you courting her. This is stuck. 
in limbo, in suspension. Somebody is in suspension, stuck, resisting change. I mean, I can't make that shit up. There may be some divided loyalty here with these twos, okay? You know, and now we got the other two. We got this two, so we got four twos here. Twos are about partnerships. There's decisions that need to be made. You're, you need to make a serious decision. Three of them are reversed now. Three of these twos are reversed. Things are very unbalanced. It's time to bring balance back to your life. And the only way to do that is to make a decision and stick to it. A lot of flippy flopping here, flip flopping, going back and forth, which is keeping you stuck keeping you in limbo. You have an opportunity to be saved from a unrequited love situation. You do, but you have to make that choice. You have to recognize that you have to make that choice to move into a new relationship and let go of the one that's not stable, solid, and secure. So anyway, I think that you guys have a serious choice to make because now you have potential. You have potential to start a new life, a new relationship with someone, but you're still holding on to the last one. So you need to make a decision. What's it going to be? choices big time with these twos be authentic and be yourself time to take that next step it's time to take that next step stop holding on to a false sense of security seriously you guys are reluctant to move on and you you probably have a new suitor here a new partnership that could make you very happy It's time of transition. You have the opportunity to move to a better place. But you may not be aware. You may There could be some self-loathing here. There could be some self-doubt. You may be hoping for a reconciliation that's not coming. You know, you need to put your guard up. You need to protect yourself. You need to do what's right for you. You need to... You're probably pushing other people away, hoping for a reconciliation with somebody that... left you hanging somebody that left you hanging left you on your own left you to fend for yourself you're hoping for love you're hoping for a reconciliation for somebody that left you there's no reciprocation there somebody's hanging on to a one-sided situation and it's time it's time to take that six six it's time to bring balance it's time to take that journey it's time to go after what you deserve there is an opportunity for love here there's an opportunity for a relationship a new relationship if you could make that decision to make that choice to choose the new opportunity instead of holding on to the one that there's no reciprocation in so it's choice time twos are choices you have to make the choice You have this divided loyalty. That, seriously, twos are divided loyalties. Like you don't know which way to go. Well, I'm here to tell you that you have a new love here. You do. You do. You know, that could that could take you out of this darkness. Some of you are letting your old victim mentality, the circumstances that you are in, restrict you. Not putting in effort into a new relationship, but you have somebody that's better suited for you. But you keep getting distracted by what you have always known. You know, you keep getting distracted. Going back to what you... Confusion, you know, letting your old ways hinder you. This is your old patterns. You know, you have somebody, it's like somebody wants to get in a relationship with you or they want to offer you love or but you're not taking the opportunity, you're overanalyzing, you're focused on the loss, not seeing that you have an opportunity for love. Libra, you have a real opportunity for love here with somebody. My advice is to give them a chance. It's an opportunity for a relationship with somebody that is better suited for you if you could stop focusing on the loss. And that's what I see. Somebody's holding on to a dead end. 
It's time to stand up and live again. And that's what I have. You're probably going to receive an invitation or a message from somebody that excites you. Go for it. Go for it. That's what I see. Good luck.